Pisces, Pisces, how you doing? Let's just make sure we're recording. We are Jeremy, Julian, Destin, Justin, Jackie, Jasmine, Jack. How you doing? Could be doing for life part seven or a Cancerian Pisces. Uh, in and out the door, like must like Gemini. I'm also picking up a Gemini for you. Very busy, maybe traveling, could be driving, doing a driving job or something like that. I'm also saying Rob, robbing, but oh, okay, robbing, robbing Peter to pay Paul. Could be Paul, Pucci, Pisces, another Piscean. Anyway. Let's see, robbing. I don't know. It feels like that things are like really expensive, Pisces. Hopefully it's not my Patreon. Let's see. Pisces, what's going on with me fish for the next 48 for Pisces? Um, so you could be dating a Leo or an Aquarian, or you've got it in your chart. I read in numerology. Wow, you got also Scorpio, the death card, trying to remain silent. <laughs> you have the right to remain silent. I don't know. If, like, there's this, you know when you walk into a bar and there's, like, silence and you're kind of like, oh, what's the matter? <laughs> okay. Um, but mm, it feels like that you are back-to-back, -back, pretty much, like, back-to-black. Back-to-back. I don't know what that on earth is. That's for back-to-back. -back. Uh, Jack, Julian, uh, Pisces, next 48. Enough, it's not telling me anything at the minute. Yeah, not speaking. So the page of wands can be someone that's acting very childish. Now, it might be your ch your children if you've got them, but the page of wands, it can be very eccentric in the way that it's kind of like, well, I'm at home and I'm not speaking and I'm not reaching out to you until you reach out to me. So I'm here if you want me, but I'm not going to ring first. I'm not going to be the first one to speak. So I think that your problems are maintaining within the next 48 hours is to see how long you can maintain silence with this person. So if you're like, well, I'm going to have to reach out to them at some point, this person, I think this could be a Leo, Page of Wands here, okay, um, is kind of like, well, I'm at home, Eight of Swords, I'm here if you want me, and I'm going to wait until you ring or call me, but I am not going to call you. Right, it's, it's, it says what it does on the 10 Pisces, really, but that's pretty much what it's telling me. Next 48 hours, I'm possibly dating this person, but I'm sticking my heels in and I am not reaching out to you unless you reach out to me. Why? Dunno. Ask the Leo. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, Pisces, next 48 hours for me fish. Um, oh, okay. Page of Pentacles, you've got clients. See, you're more than likely in love with this person, but I think you go through this like... Like, communication is a problem. Like, they all say communication is key in a relationship. But I feel that communication is always a problem between you and this person, whichever way around it is. Eight of Swords can be like, I'm at home, I'm bored, I'm fed up. Do you want to go anywhere? Knight of Pentacles, no. <laughs> so we're not going out tonight. We're not going out within the next 48 hours. I love you and I'm with you, but I'm basically... It's kind of like you don't live with this person, right? It might be someone that you're dating... Okay, or in a relationship with, but actually don't live with this person. And they have to call you to allow you to come over or wait for you to find out if you're going over. Okay, are you coming over tonight? Don't know. Okay. That's what I'm kind of picking up. I know it's straightforward, Pisces. Now, if you're looking for the page of wands and the knight of pentacles to be any kind of action that anybody's taking towards you within money... I don't think so. This means that Steve's not going to get any patrons. No one's really going to join. Nothing really is changing within the next 48 hours. It's just kind of like waiting to find out if I've got any clients or, you know, if you know, if I'm working or not. I don't know if I'm working or not working. You could be self-employed and you don't know whether you're going to work or not. I'm definitely hearing not, and that's my Pisces head card. So I'm hearing, well, I don't really know yet because I don't know if I'm working or not. And the Knight of Pentacles is someone that loves to make a plan. Okay, so can we plan to go out tomorrow? And the answer is, well, I don't know. It depends if I'm working or not. Well, are you? Well, I don't know. So I can't tell you whether we can meet up or not because I don't actually know and haven't got any word of whether I'm actually working or not yet. Okay. So tell me more about this strength card of the energy coming from Leo here and this strength card. What is going through this strength card's head? What do they think and feel? Um, so the Wheel of Fortune 
and also the four of pentacles. Oh, okay. So you could be like myself, like you've got Aquarius and Venus and Mars, like four and four. <clears throat> so you've got like this saving money, okay? Do you want to go out? Can't, I'm saving money. Okay, do you want to come over tonight? I can't, I'm washing my hair, Dave, all right? Um, four of pentacles can also be someone that's blocking, but it's also blaming, can also blame. It can be a person that's that that is like fire signs, <laughs> Leos. <laughs> but say if you've got a very difficult Leo that's all up in their head and they're not letting go of something, if they're angry, they're trying not to say anything. The Four of Pentacles is, well, I think you're stubborn and arrogant and I'm not reaching out to you until you reach out to me. I'm just sticking by my guns and I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to go quiet, silent, not reach out to you, not say anything unless you reach out to me. It's the same story. Okay, so what's the death card here for, for Pisces and the next 48? Okay, I love these 48-hour readings because a lot of these in my life come true. I don't know about you guys, but I'm like, oh, shit, yeah. <laughs> so Knight of Wands, not saying this is coming true for me, but Knight of Wands is a response. So a Scorpio in this deck, if you have got Scorpio in your chart, your Pisces, Scorpio, something like that, right? This is where you are prepared to reach out and ask this person what they're doing. The Knight of Wands, like I said, is, is this Knight of Wands, Page of Wands. I'm not reaching out and going to say anything until you're big enough to reach out to me. This person's acting more like, I don't know if they use tactics of going quiet. Like, I'll go quiet and I'll not say anything. And then if you don't reach out, then tomorrow I'll blame you for not reaching out and then say, well, you didn't bother about me yesterday. And you're like, well, yesterday's yesterday. Today's today. <laughs> right? So communication, speaking, more than likely going out. Okay? At least speaking. Okay? Now, for some of you here, you might be interested in someone new. Knight of, Pet, Knight of Wands, Page of Wands is basically just kind of like very curious about somebody like, mm, you've really intrigued my interest. Like, I'm really interested in you, but I, but it's new. It's just a, like a spark. It's, it's kind of like that, oh, there was a little bit of something there. <laughs> right? <clears throat> you meet someone, you talk to them, and you're like, oh, I felt something, did you? <laughs> Not unless your dick fell out. Let's see. Page of Wands. Told you, bruv. It says what it says up here in the spirit world. Yeah. <laughs> the Page of Wands and the night and the High Priestess. Going quiet, silent, playing the silent game. Now, you might be the one that's going silent on this person. Because I feel like someone pulls temper tantrums. And the way they pull attention to a temper tantrum in order to end up getting what they want, which is vocabulary, they do it in a way of being quiet to get vocabulary. Meaning like you could be sitting there thinking, okay, if I don't reach out to this person, I know for a fact that they're going to flip out tomorrow or the next day or in the next 48 hours. So I really better like just message them just to make sure that they're all right. And you do but they're hiding something about that may be going on that you could have had an argument about. And you ask them and you say, are you all right? They're like, yeah. Are you, are you sure? Like, just like, are you all right? And they're like, yeah, no, I'm fine. Just not how you normally act. You're normally like, yeah, no, I'm fine. How are you? Are you all right? Do you want to go out tonight? Right? Like that. But this person's kind of like, yeah, no, I'm fine. You're like, bruv, you're acting a little bit weird. What's the matter with you? And you're like, Nothing. You're like, oh, okay, here we go. What's on your mind now? Nothing, nothing. And you're like, there is something on your mind because you're going quiet. What's the matter? No, you told me not to say. Like, oh, so so. hold on a minute. So this means that I've done something wrong like a child and you're going to treat me like a child because I've done something wrong. What have I done wrong now? Nothing. You told me not to mention it. So you're going to think about it, stew on it, not speak, not say anything, Act like a child and then blame me if I don't. And, and you know, even I'm getting frustrated, Pisces. Who is this person? <laughs> <clears throat> now, let's see. Now, some of you could be the children of mothers. You know, you're not speaking to your mother or your father. Okay. Definitely, if you've got Jeff, Steph, Steve, and an ex, 
if you've got an ex-husband or a wife and this has got divorced in the past for like Libra energy and separation and divorce, it feels like we're not even talking. Like we're not even talking, Dave. Like this can be twat flames that have got such a connection with someone. It's kind of like, well, I've got nothing to do but just sit and do nothing and wait and think about this person and just hope if I click my heels together, they might reach out to me, but I'm just going to sit and wait. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, Pisces. Okay, let's see. Now, when I did, I, I've just done three or four readings for the week over on Patreon. And, ooh, some of them have changed from the last 48 hours of what I was doing. Who cool, have they changed? <laughs> Uh, oh, actually, I'm, see I'm seeing this, uh, hearing this message of like, cool, I haven't seen you in a while. My God, have you changed? You're like, you've got tall. So it might be someone's like grandchildren or kids or something. And they're like, God, I haven't seen you or spoke to you in a while. You've grown. How you've grown. <laughs> right? Here. Yeah. Eight of swords. Eight of cups. <laughs> it's like this person, right? Can you see them? Yeah. Right. It's like they want you to go over and visit and stay there. Right. They want you to stay or sleep or stay over, but go over there. But they're not going to ask you to go over there, but they want you to go over there. Like, how do you guys communicate? Is it Ebert? Ebert? <laughs> you know, is it like alien how you like speak to win another <laughs> oh yeah that's great wagga wagga <laughs> but it does it feels like that Pisces this person actually wants you to go over and stay there and be around them but won't ask you to do that, they'll just go quiet until you do that. <laughs> like, And then I bet you that if you don't do that, this person will then turn around eventually and say, well, I wasn't doing anything the other night, but you didn't want to come over then, did you? <laughs> right? so, um, what's the page of Pentacles for the next 48 hours for Pisces? Six of Wands. I mean, you have got an attention-seeking energy there. Yeah, it is. It's kind of like someone trying to bend you around their finger by playing the silent game until you crack. And then you're kind of like, well, I'm a grown-up, Pisces. I'm a grown-up. They're more of a child. So I'm going to have to be the bigger person to reach out to them because they're obviously not going to do it to me. So I'm going to have to be the bigger person. I'm going to have to let my ego go aside and I know how to communicate because I'm a fish. So I'll talk to them. I'll let it, you know, I know they want me to, so I'm going to do that. And then Unky Dory Dave, this person gets what they want, okay, the fool and the six of ones, and suddenly you are back together being as you was before, back in love and doing whatever it is. But this is a complication of a lesson of whatever it is about someone getting Mardi. This is normally, I mean, do you know Leo's? <laughs> but <laughs> they, no, they can normally get very Mardi, like, <laughs> okay, like quiet, reserved, you know, like, fucking, like, what's the matter? Like, no, you're like, stop being so quiet. And you're like, well, and you can see it going around in the head. They're like, mm -hmm. <laughs> like, like, grow up. <laughs> like, just grow up, right? What do you want now? What's the matter now? And it's kind of like, well, I want to do that. And you're like, oh, Jesus, what is it? A narc kid? I don't want to say thing. I want to go out. And you're like, you might want to go out, sweetheart, but I can't afford to take you out. What, are you paying? You're like, well, no, I'm not paying. You're like, well, if you're not paying and I can't afford to pay, then who's paying? God? No. Well, what do we do? Stay in. Oh, but I want to go out. Like, Bruv. <laughs> there you go, Pisces. A little bit of entertainment for you. 
Bryant, Robbie, Robert, Robertson, <coughs> Harrison, Ford. Anyway, so thanks very much, guys. Really do appreciate it. I hope you've been, uh, enjoyed the entertainment. Please make sure that you watch the videos all the way through. I should have said this at the beginning. All the way through for its entirety from now on, whenever you watch one of my videos, please do not click off. It really disturbs the algorithm. And then just smash that like button and leave a comment and subscribe if you haven't. It's not much, okay? There are loads of YouTube. It's not going to matter if you just subscribe, is it? What's it going to matter? It's just going to go into your account. You're going to forget that I'm there because you're subscribed to 10 million anyway. So you might as well just hit my subscribe button. It doesn't matter. Helps me out. <laughs> right? But, like, you know, all links are provided below. If you want Patreon or the Join button, you can find loads of different things. I'm actually probably selling single reading, so you can buy the single if you want. Okay, I'll post it up over on there. Just look for where it says the shop. Okay, and I've got loads of teaching videos that are there now. So I'm adding them one by one because I'm having to upload them as videos on there. But once you've paid, it's yours. So a lot of people say, Steve, I want this teaching video and I can't remember or what or want it and I can't remember where it is. Well, I'm uploading them individually for £3 each and you can buy it and then, it, then it's yours. You don't rent it, you buy it. Okay, £3, all of my teaching videos eventually will be in on Patreon where it says shop. OK, but if you want to join the monthly subscription, they're all on there anyway, but you need to go to it. If you want the silver tier, that's where the weeklies and monthlies are. OK, or the join button below. There's loads of different things you can join Pisces. We're having a heyday. We're having a sale. All right, Alexis. Right. So thanks very much, guys. Really do appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. <laughs>